In 2015, the Center for Medical Progress released a video on which you stated, quote, I'm like, oh my God, I get it. When the skull is broken, that's really sharp. I get it. I understand why people are talking about getting that skull out, that culvarium. Culvarium being an incomplete skull. When abortion has crushed the skulls of babies to kill them, what physical risks are there for the baby? So, Congressman, thank you for the question. It allows me to clarify that the media products you're referring to stoked a massive uptick in violence. Those heavily edited, misleadingly edited media products caused three murders and nine woundings in Colorado Springs in 2015. The, the question was about the baby and the skull crushing that is, I think, a direct quote attributed to you. Like, oh my God, I get it. When the skull is broken, that's really sharp. I don't get it. I don't understand why people are talking about getting that skull out that area. The folks who distributed those media products may have attributed something to me. I can't speak to So, true or false, did you say that? I'm like, oh my God, I get it. When the skull is broken, that's really sharp. Did you say that? It's impossible to know, Congressman. Would you have said that? Is that something you would have said? I don't know, Congressman. You don't know. You don't know if you talked about the crushing of the skull of a baby. You don't remember having said something like that. I do I'm pretty confident I've never said something like that. I'm quite confident my colleagues here have never said something like that. Have you ever said something about crushing the skull of the baby, particularly in that kind of a setup? I believe, Congressman, that we all came here today to agree that violence is never an appropriate response to policy yeah, differences. That, that, uh, that seems pretty violent, the crushing of the skull of a baby. I think that actually is the definition of violence. And I think the question here is, is whether or not uh, we are uh, going to acknowledge and recognize that reality and the extent to which now the federal government has been weaponized against the people who want to acknowledge that reality. That's the question. Mr. Houck has stood up and said, I'd like to recognize the reality of the violence against a baby. And by the way, the violence against the mother, the mother who's been sold a myth by radical leftists in the name of baby killing, They've been sold a myth that it is somehow healthy and good for them or better than for them. And if someone dares stands up like Mr. Houck, then he's been targeted, as my colleague acknowledged from this very dais, targeted by the Federal Bureau of Investigation, which we saw was weaponized specifically against the President of the United States, as we just saw in the Durham report, is weaponized against average citizens.